I don't have anything to prove. I don't have any pressure. I don't feel any of that. For me, it's going out there and playing my game, trying to help my team win. And Jay Will all of a sudden got a huge headache. He's rubbing his eyes. Oh, you want some? You want something? You no, okay? It, what do you I, think? I, 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 it's the I don't have anything to prove. Mm -hmm. Like you have everything to prove. You want to win a championship, you, and that's why we all play this game. And I get all the individual accolades. I get people saying that he's, and I, I'm one of these people. He's one of the most innovative offensive players I think the game of basketball has ever seen. But at the end of the day, James Harden has been so close to winning championships that this is probably one of his best opportunities to do so, playing alongside a guy that should be the MVP of the league, having a top 15 all-time coach on the sideline, having the right defensive schemes in place. There should be something for everybody to prove. And just saying that, that doesn't sound like the truth from James Harden. Really? It I don't buy it. I, I think my mission is genuine. He can look, he can put that forward for public consumption, make everybody think, man, this is, you're not going to affect me. This doesn't bother me. I, I, I'm good with who I am and where I'm at. The truth of the matter is, I don't believe that's where his mind is at when he's by himself. He has more to prove than any player in the postseason by a mile. And he knows that internally. What he should say, this is what people would say to me, well, what do you want him to say in that situation? Man, I feel all the pressure in the world. No, how about this? Mm. How about this? Yes, I do have a lot to prove because I haven't won a championship and I want to be a champion. And I came here to help Joel Embiid win a championship. And I know this city has expectations. They haven't won here in 40 years. I'm here to help us try to do that. So, yes, I feel it and I hope I can deliver on it. What's wrong with saying that? Acknowledge the fact, though, that people are looking at you and some of your past playoff performances and you were brought here for one specific reason, to win. And they gave up a lot to get you. Just acknowledge that that exists. Because when you take that attitude in a market like Philly, if you don't play well when you lose and that's how you approached it, they're never going to forget that. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.